two players we see pretty often, so. But I think we're gonna get right into the next match here, actually. Uh, we got Zane and Cobra. Oh boy, getting this train running right away. So this is one of the one of my favorite matchups to watch in this game because these characters, if they have good close quarters games, they just destroy each other. Yeah. So it's gonna be it's gonna be back and forth the whole night, and it's gonna be quite an explosive set if I might uh, take is, it literally here. That is quite literally. Yeah. Anytime you got Snake in the matchup, you're gonna see explosives left and right. So what do you think about the PS2 pick right off the bat? Uh, you know, I think it's a solid pick for sure. Any game one, you know, you go here, feel each other out, kind of see how your opponent uh, reacts. So, I mean, I think this should be a solid pick. I think they may have daft. Wow, all right. <laughs> all right. Crushing <laughs> forward smash coming out from Cobra, taking that first stock. Not even 40 Ooh. seconds into the match, and Cobra yeah. has a pretty commanding lead, setting the pace of this match. Absolutely. So, you know, Zane, Zane I think... Snake, though. Able to bring this back, which is a few explosives for sure. I think a low percent snake is definitely worse off than a high percent snake is because he can just get comboed all over the place if um, mm. we get one up air or one opening for Cobra here. Yeah, being on the heavier side of the waitlist, he's susceptible to some early game combos, especially against Mario. And on top of that, his disadvantage state isn't the best in the game. Absolutely. Yeah, a lot of players think it is though, but. Yeah, he's got those Ooh, grenades, right. uh, which you, you can try to use to uh, trade and break combos. The problem with that is that it can also help you uh, get juggled. Yeah, that and is true. That, nobody wants that against Mario. Yeah, you can end, end up taking more percent than you're saving yourself from. Oh, wow! Another okay. forward smash. He catches Ooh. that back air with the extended legs. Yeah, that was, that was some super great spacing there from Cobra, claiming another stock with that explosive forward smash. So Zane's going to have to try to reset the tempo of the match and put it back into um, something he's a little bit more comfortable with because the high pressure situations that Cobra's been causing are definitely not looking good for Zane. Yeah, absolutely. I think we're uh -oh. getting a little bit of connection, but I think we're going <laughs> to... Ultimate online, baby! Yeah, <laughs> slip right through it there. Just a little spike. I think we're all good now. Fingers crossed about that one. Yeah, hopefully we won't see too much more of that. At all least right. you don't lie to you guys like Nintendo does. <laughs> Gotta stay just true. You guys are aware, uh, the players aren't actually experiencing any lag. It's just <laughs> a, a glitch in the recording. Yeah. But Even though the most of you saw that smash ball on the bottom right. Ooh, Ooh the, the reset. Ball? Yeah, nice. Ooh. Not quite enough just yet, but he's close to that kill percent, especially with that rage. Both these guys are looking for their um, respective upwards ground. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the up smash and the up tilt coming up for both these guys. Yeah, they need on beautiful. the oh! <laughs> Wow, all right. So the question of the day, did the grenade kill him or did the uppie kill him? I really don't know. I, I want to say the grenade did. I feel like the uppie popped it and just made him go off the top there, but that was that was interesting way to end yeah. it for sure. What really sucks is that if uh, that didn't hit Zane, um, it would have been last stock for both of these guys. Yeah, that is true. Wow, yeah, Cobra with a strong first game, and he's going to take it. So I'm interested to see what the counter pick is going to be here, because yes, um, if I'm not mistaken, you guys have the full uh, list of counter picks. Um, yeah, I, th I think we do. Um, I think we run Kalos, Lilat, yeah, Yoshi's. Yeah, okay, Yoshi's and Battlefield are the two I'm concerned with uh, yeah. as a Mario. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's gonna be interesting. Oh, oh okay. Going like from Zane. Yeah. Interesting. So yeah. two of the things that Mario does struggle with are swords and projectiles. And look, Young well, Link's got both. <laughs> He's got them both, yeah. We've definitely seen Zane's Young Link before here on Peak, and it's definitely not something you cannot uh, sleep on. So we will see if it pays off here with the character switch. Oh, the forward <laughs> air. Oh! Whoa! I don't think so, buddy. <laughs> And that is uh, a quick, like, 15 second stock. Oh my yeah, goodness. The first one was 40, and I thought that was impressive. This one yeah. was like 15. Dang, what an explosive start once again from Cobra. <laughs> one combo and then a cherry on top. Yeah. It's gonna take it. Uh, dreaded Mario Ford Ariel, and now Zane having a lot of work to make up for. If he wants to have a chance in this set. Zane's just playing a little bit too up close and personal with Mario. His close quarters game, um, 
is fine as Young Link and Snake has a decent one as well. But Mario's is one of the best in the game, and if he gets one combo starter on you, that could be half a stock gone. Absolutely. And like we saw earlier, that forward air isn't something yeah. to sleep on either. <laughs> no, that will take your stock in just a matter of seconds. Oh, wow. Ooh, goes for the read. Oh. Gotta respect it. When you're this far in the driver's seat like the, uh, like Cobra yeah. is, He's you can himself. go for that sort of thing. Absolutely. Yeah, Zane looking to find this kill, but you know, Young Link can have some tough time finding that kill option. So we'll see if he's able to make it in. Dang, perfect shield on that uh, up smash. All right, he's gonna snap back through the flood. Uh, I think he's tethered there. Yeah. <laughs> I was I was uh, a little bit confused as to what that was. Yeah, eye was, on that. That was up interesting. Yeah. There we go. Ooh. Fair. Finds the fourth throw. Okay, so he's not out of this one yet. Uh, as I've seen, it looks like he's playing just a little bit more passively. And if he can get those stray hits, maybe rack up some damage, get a you know combo like he's got going on here, um, yeah. that, he might be able to bring this one back and put it you know a little bit more in his favor. Absolutely, yeah. Something that Cobra's been doing, uh, not overusing that cape to reflect the projectiles, not becoming predictable. You know, he's using it when he needs to, when he's in a dangerous spot. So I think he's been really using that cape effectively to combat against Zane's projectiles. He really only uses it when he knows it's going to hit, because yeah. he doesn't want to get baited out. Exactly, yeah. That's a problem with a lot of uh, characters the reflectors have against uh, more projectile-based characters. Yeah. Okay, almost gets the combo there, but doesn't quite go for the last hit on that arrow conversion. Oh, Ooh, wow. Oh. Smash. Just ran what? up. That was a very good second stock for Zane. Yeah. He definitely get, did bring it back quite a little bit. Absolutely. Now he's just got to seal the, the deal on this one, and uh, we're going to be looking at an even match. Yeah. Oh, okay. Heart stop for a second there. <laughs> Heart reads are probably the biggest mind game you could possibly play, because if it works, it demoralizes your opponent so much yeah. because they think they shouldn't have gotten hit by that. But if, if it, even if it doesn't work, your opponent is going to be a little bit more cautious of you uh, trying to go for stuff like that, and they might panic a little bit more often. Yep. All right, edge guard opportunity here for Cobra. Nice. Uh oh. Smart. Doesn't go for it's the four trapped. there. Yeah. Okay. Zane gets back on stage. But can he survive? It's the question. Ooh. Ooh, laggy. Yeah, that was not safe. Oh, oh yeah. That's going to do it. Yep. Strong up smash coming from Cobra. This is winter semis, if I'm not mistaken, right? Yes, winter semifinals, yeah. And that's going to be 2-0 for Cobra. A strong step coming out from him.